Speaking of making everybody miserable, we got Disney to talk about tonight. <laughs> you suck! I love that. Am I wrong oh my here? God. That is so funny. Perfect image. Okay. There was there wasn't an image really with the with the PDF of the article. So it's enough. Doesn't matter that one is just perfect. Yeah. yeah. Uh, a Disney resort is facing backlash for appearing to charge guests stranded by Hurricane Milton for emergency sandwich kits. The kits include peanut butter, jelly, a loaf of bread, and utensils are being sold for ten dollars to those affected by the natural disaster. Uh, millions have been affected by Hurricane Milton, which has hit Florida and its surrounding areas. The Category 3 storm has led to at least 14 deaths, 3.4 million power outages, and significant damage, which has yet to be determined. Those on yeah. holiday at Disneyland Resort in Orlando, Florida, have also found themselves stranded. Yeah, you may not be able to get back home. While Disney's gesture of goodwill was initially praised, reactions soon turned sour and users learned that the kits were not free for those affected. A video of the food packages was shared by TikTok's self-proclaimed Disney mama, Alyssa Sprake. Such a good idea, and they discounted board games, she wrote in such a viral clip, which accrued millions of views since it was first posted. It should be free, wrote one person in the comments. The fact that they are charging for sandwiches right now is wild at another. I was thinking, oh, how sweet. They then saw they were charging $10, commented a third person. Uh, others pointed out that the company's vast wealth and influence, saying Disney is a corporation, so they could literally for those to get these away. I'm sorry, it's a jar of peanut butter, a loaf of a jar, jar, a loaf of bread, yeah. and some utensils. You could give that away. And keep in mind, you got to look at this the 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 overarching. Um, there, there's a lot that goes into this. This doesn't take place in a vacuum. So we've just had several years of of lawsuits between Disney and the state of Florida over politics. And one of their specific arguments is how we actually care more about the people of Florida than you do. We employ this many people and that brings this much revenue into Florida, blah, 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 this and that. Yeah, well, you pretty much crap all over anyone even trying to entertain that argument by pulling this kind of crap. What is wrong? You don't care about anybody. The gesture is meaningless. It was free. They shouldn't have just done it. They shouldn't have done it. Right. I mean, I mean, meanwhile, we have better. Elon up in, in Tennessee giving literally free access for the rest of the year to his whatever Skynet or whatever it is, so that people have internet connections. Don't say Skynet. Anyway, yeah, I know. Right. Why is everyone saying it should be free for one person? If these people were home, they would have to pay for groceries during the storm. It's the best price for both items they could possibly offer. I don't know if that's the best price for both items they could possibly offer. It's not like peanut butter and jelly is that expensive. Yeah, I'll tell you exactly why. Because they're not just sitting at home with a day off with their feet up. These people may have very well lost their houses. They yeah. may not have any money right now. You would have to pay for food anyways if the storm didn't hit. If someone has a meal plan, they should be allowed to use credit for it, though, if they wanted. Uh, one guest also the business insider that people stranded at the resort were offered a 40% discount on accommodations during the disaster and discounted meals at hotel restaurants. Okay, that discounted, I'm not going to, okay, the discounted accommodations, that's that's good. I'm not going to say that isn't, but th this just, ugh. I'm also going to say this too. Um We've had local business, like a local pizza pizza place during one of our hurricanes was actually just delivering pizzas to people, you know, for uh, for for free in the aftermath of a storm. OK, yeah. And, and, you know, it's not like I'm expecting Disney, by the way, but you're just going to have simple peanut butter and jelly. Give it out. It's yes. Ridiculous. You, you, I, it would be yeah. good. It would be good. It would be good for, you know, your um, image. Your yeah. tarnished image and right you now. Definitely, definitely need to improve that image because you nobody likes you now, Disney. Uh, this this doesn't help you at all. Yeah, but anyway, I'm sorry. I thought that picture was perfect though for that article. But uh, yeah, dismal Disney. I mean, I don't know. Uh, and jelly, give him some jam at least, right? I mean. <laughs> I don't you know, know. Went to Cracker Barrel today and I got a couple of uh, little things of grape jam and I just took it home with me. See, so, you know, they give you out with the things. So there we go. Uh, this makes me furious because illegal migrants are being put up luxury hotels in New York for free. Well, that's the that's thing. another they good point. Tons of free stuff from the federal government. And of course, yeah. this is business. They don't have to give this stuff out, but it would be a good yeah. gesture. Yeah. <sighs> Look, it's all about optics. You know, you have you have a choice. 
uh, this probably is not the best choice. 